Well, this part is about installing the uh, pit at the end of the uh, channel. And basically, I've just bought this uh, pit from the hardware house. Um, it's just a pit with a short length of uh, drain. The pit is about 300 uh, cent, uh, millimeter, so it's about a foot. Cut the uh, uh, along here for uh, for fitting the short length of uh, drain. Um, it's, it's guided with the uh, pre-cut line, so it's very easy. So this will fit down quite snugly. Um, I noticed after fitting it, the cover will not cover on properly. It's because it is, uh, this top bit is jutting out a little bit, so I need to trim it off. Trim off for about a centimeter. Here, close-up view on this. Um, <coughs> okay, you'll see the cover doesn't cover down uh, snugly. So that's the drain, uh, trim off about a centimeter, both down and uh, across. Now the cover fits uh, better. Next job is to drill the hole for the um, uh, down pipe, stormwater pipe. Uh, I'm going to put the hole a bit higher than the uh, suggested um, uh, hole. Um, with this, I will be able to trap dirt that uh, you know happen to flow into it and um, easy for cleaning. So this is all done. Uh, the next bit is to <coughs> get to the site. I need to dig a hole for the pit and the uh, a trench for the drain, <coughs> and uh, then channel the water down to the tank over there. And so this uh, bearing of the stormwater uh, pipe is the most difficult bit, and I'm leaving it to the end. So uh, the uh, hole and the trench is done. Test for size, I'm happy with it. <coughs> so next job is to uh, set it in place with um, a bit of cement, uh, sand, sand and cement mix with um, a bit of uh, stone in them. So job done. On to the next bit. <coughs>